Game Jolt (GJ) is a hosting service for freeware and commercial video games in browser and a downloadable client with social functions. The initial site was launched on January 1, 2004, and was founded by David Cross de Carmine. Topic: History. Topic. 2003–2007 Development of Game Jolt started in 2002 as Hollow World, which then was renamed to Game Jolt in 2003. The site publicly launched on July 29, 2004 and included a public account system, forums, a chatroom and games, uploaded with the respective creator's permission. In 2007 the site was taken down due to inactivity. 2008–present In December 2008, David launched a second version of the site with Game Jolt becoming a game portal. The site was completely redesigned and introduced an automated uploading system for downloadable games, as well as Flash, Unity and Java games. Ad revenue sharing was publicly released in September 2009 from its closed beta, which gave users a 30% share on advertising revenue on their game pages, profiles and blog posts. The site had much automated spam from mid-2011 to early 2012, which resulted in inactivity of the community as well as its owner. The Game Jolt API came out of its 3-year beta in July 2012 allowing games to integrate with the site. Game Jolt started accepting browser-based HTML5 games for upload in February 2013. David DeCarmine announced on August 8 that he was working full-time on Game Jolt's development, leaving his job at Zulily in the process. Indie Static, a now defunct indie games related news aggregator and blog, announced it was partnering with Game Jolt in October 2013. This brought an article stream on the front page and articles of Game Jolt hosted games show up on the said game's profile, with a game portal congregated by Indie Static and served by Game Jolt planned but never came to fruition. Game Jolt Jams released in early 2014 as a service to allow users to create their own game jams that integrated with the main site. A beta for a new site overhaul was made public in June 2015 and was released later that month, with Game Jolt advertising a responsive design, automated curation for both games and game news articles, which weighs how recent a game was uploaded and how popular it is. Hot and filtering options on game listings for platform, maturity rating and development status in January 2016. Game Jolt released source code of the client and site's front end on GitHub under MIT license. An online marketplace was announced in April 2016 and released the following month in May, allowing developers to sell their games on the site. Topic: <laughs> Let's Player Partnerships. In November 2014 Game Jolt announced the ''Indies vs PewDiePie'' game jam, partnering with the popular YouTuber Felix ''PewDiePie'' Gelberg. Developers were given a weekend 21 November to create a game with the theme of ''Fun to play, fun to watch'' to suit the Let's Play's entertainment style. Users could rate entries afterwards until December 1 when the scores were counted up. The prize to the top 10 rated games was Felix playing the games on his channel as a means of promotion for the developers, although later he played other entries. Game Jolt partnered with Felix, Sean, Jacksepticeye, McLaughlin, and Mark, Markiplier, Fishbach to host, Indies vs. Gamers, in July 2015. The requirements for entries were arcade games using the GJAPI high score tables, to be made between the July 17 to 20 and the top five games were played on the partner's YouTube channels. API The Game Jolt application programming interface usually known as the GJ API allows any developer using a game development platform that supports HTTP operations and MD5 or SHA-1. Game Jolt advertises that the API can create multiple scoreboards which collect high scores from players made publicly available on the game's profile and give user accounts EXP award players trophies which give user accounts EXP Store game data on Game Jolt's data servers. 
Topic: Competitions. Game Jolt has hosted numerous official game development contests with varying requirements and rewards. Contests are differentiated from jams. A contest on Game Jolt refers to a competition wherein developers have a single theme their game must follow if they enter the competition, and an ordered subjective top games selection is found either from judging by the staff or, with the two recent Indies vs's competitions, community voting. A jam however has no requirements and only an optional theme, which may or may not be judged but with no prizes for the winners. Contests Jams Jams are hosted on the weekend. Unlike the contests there is no theme just work on new games or WIPs. Developers are encouraged to livestream, post screenshots and tweet about whatever they're developing, with no winners are produced at the end. 